WTFNN. Headline News Update. And welcome to the 2 p.m. update with me, David White. It, uh, you know, we've got, uh, well, is that right? I think that's about right. Uh, we've uh, dipped down just under 3,900 on the S&P cash. Uh, news uh, broke uh, not too long ago, what, about 30, 45 minutes ago, uh, and uh, tipped the market lower. That news was that the Russian MiGs, the MiG-29, had uh, run into a, a Reaper drone a couple of times and uh, crashed it into the uh, Black Sea. According to uh, the Defense Department, uh, it was in international airspace at the time, and they were doing all kinds of stuff like dumping fuel on it, trying to get it to just uh, die naturally. But uh, no such luck. They had to actually hit it with one of the other planes. Uh, doesn't know whether that uh, we don't know if that was intentional or just that they were bad pilots or uh, of course did it on purpose on an order so that it could say that maybe it was just a bad pilot but you don't know and of course uh, as we uh, deal with uh, other nuclear nations on an ongoing basis it could be problematic after the bell tonight, uh, we need to start looking forward to Lennar, uh, to, to L-E-N, right? And I didn't want to, oh, come on, L-E-N. Why is it? Eh, come on. Oh, because I did something here. I unplugged my keyboard. Uh, L-E-N. So let's see here. Well, it's up 1%. This is the first good reading we're going to be getting on housing sales uh, because uh, this was the um, – for I think this uh, their quarter closed on the 1st of February. So we're going to see a little bit of how those higher interest rates uh, that were going on uh, affected their sales and get their read on it. So we've got uh, World War III housing sales – a little bit of everything. We'll be back in a minute. 